Viewer discretion is advised. What's up, y'all? Welcome to a brand new episode of Train Simulator 2020. Today, we're going to be on the Marias Pass route. I'm uh, going to be doing a scenario with the EMD SW1500 switcher. Uh, we are basically going to be assembling a mixed freight train by adding grain hoppers and center beam cars at Shelby. So essentially, we're just adding on to the rear end of the train for the most part. Uh, let's go ahead and hop in the scenario and see what it's all about. Welcome to Shelby. You have a half-assembled train which is scheduled to depart Shelby within the hour. Finish by adding grain hoppers and center beam cars to the departing train. The grain hoppers are just in front of your switcher. Okay, so let's hop in the cab here. We go. Looks super nice. Let's go ahead and release that brake. Um, not sure why we're throttling up here. Here we go. Okay, well this is weird. Let's go and set that brake a little bit. We're moving backwards for some unknown reason. We're supposed to be moving forwards, but we're moving backwards. There we go. Alright. So these are the hopper cars that we're supposedly uh, supposed to be switching on to. Let's go ahead and set that headlight to the rear. Because we're not going to be using the front so much. We'll be using the rear more than the front. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Okay, so let's go ahead and do a safety stop. Don't think we'll be doing a safety stop. Barely. We barely just made it for a safety stop. There we go. That's a great start. Reverse back before changing direction and making your way to the westbound mixed freight train. So let's go ahead and do that. Release you. And let us go ahead and come back here. Let me go make sure that the tracks are properly switched. Which it looks like they are not. Let's go ahead and switch those real quick. There we go. Alright. Well, yeah, I hope you guys are having an awesome day so far. Awesome week as well. If you guys are enjoying the video and you guys do enjoy the video, do make sure you hit the like button. As well as that subscribe button with the bell icon. Greatly, greatly, greatly would appreciate it. As well as you guys, make sure you follow me on all the social media. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Join the Discord server as well if you want true notifications of when I upload a video. Be sure to join that Discord server. There are definite notifications every time that I go or uh, post a video, go live, all that fun stuff. So make sure you guys join that Discord server. We're just going to be taking this down to reverse point one, which is past that uh, dual signal over there, it looks like. Let's go ahead and do this because we are speeding. We're going to couple, go via Sweetgrass, main sub, and then couple to there. Grab some auto racks, and yes. Alright. I thought they said center beam cards, but I guess they're auto racks. I think this, I think there might be classifying this switch point as a signal. I don't know though. But we do got a clear indicator, so we're fine. Reverse point one. So I feel like we are going to be crossing or heading to that crossing there. So I feel like we're supposed to be clear of this signal. So I feel like we will be hitting that crossing. Oh, well, maybe not. We got five cars. We'll see. Come to a stop and set the switch ahead to take you to the Sweetgrass Main South. So maybe we won't have to go to the uh, 
switch there. So set this switch here, I believe, is what they were saying. Yep, Sweetgrass main sub. All right. So I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna watch the shove here. Cool switchers having some issues pushing five grain cars, man. Actually six. Yeah, six. Switchers having some issues, man. So yeah, we are coming up here from the main or Sweetgrass sub. Driving some hopper cars here to add to a afternoon man or late evening manifest train, I believe. It's 6.05 game time, so it'd be like a late evening train departing Shelby. I don't see why my switcher doesn't want to power up. Well, yeah, we do have an EOT device on the rear for some unknown reason. Standard protocol, but weird that they would have it on a yard move like this. But yeah, just basically watching the shove, making sure that nothing's in our way, no debris, no persons, trains, anything like that. Mixed Freight is located at Shelby Hub 2915. The switches are already set for you to get there, but you are crossing the main line. So be vigilant for signals and don't exceed 20. Okay, so they don't want us to exceed 20 miles an hour, even though we're already going to be doing that. So we are pretty much already going to be going through the crossing here. There we go. Some tank car or some grain cars running back. So they said the switches are already set for us, which is good. We'll just sound the horn, pretend to do it for the crossing. I gotta say, that is one very, very, very weird horn. So we are crossing the main line here, advanced approach. VNSF, what are we at? 20, 3417. VNSF 3417, version clear, Shelby. Two to one. So this engineer is probably like, why is there a loaded, why is there a train of grain cars? Her BNSF 3417 correction diversion approach shall be fain 2 to 1. He's like, why is there a grain cars coming at me? BNSF 3417 restricting Shelby yard entrance man 1. Oh, we're speeding. This will be a fun... I bet that'll be a very fun ride for the conductor. To have to do that. Well, that train got on the move real quick, man. Oh, I see our train. It's all the way out there. All the way out there. I see it now. Alright, there's our train coming through. I'm going to start ready to start breaking this thing for the safety stop. So we can hook up real good. To our uh, manifest train here. There we go, there's our stop. Let's go ahead and couple on.
One more. Half car. Alright, good hook. Looks in order. Uncouple the switcher. Alright, here we go. Oh, we got we already got locomotives on the on the head end. That's cool. Works for me. Center beam cars are located in this next siding along 2914. However, they are blocked by two lumber cars. Move those out of the way before picking up the center beams. Sounds like a plan. All right, let's go ahead and put it in reverse. Do that. Grab the bell. And I believe these are the center beams right here that they're talking about. And those are the lumber cars that are blocking them. Okay, so I'm kind of confused on what this says. Because it says couple auto rack cars to the front of BNSF switcher. Which I'm assuming are those two right there. Then it says couple westbound mixed freight to the front of BNSF switcher. And then drop off mixed freight. Unless they're meaning those since they're half full and half empty, I don't know. But they said they want me to get these out of the way, but it doesn't give me a location to drop them off at. So I'm not like 100% sure what they want me to actually do with it. If that makes any sense. But yeah, they never basically said where I'm supposed to be putting these two, unless I'm supposed to put them over here. Unless I'm supposed to push them with me to couple onto those and then set just couple onto those, bring them back, bring them couple on there and decouple those is what my guess is. My also thing is they're just two random lumber cars. So I don't really know what their plan is for them either. Go and set that into neutral. Start setting that brake there. Mighty fine looking switcher. Burlington BN Green. There we go. Switch is set on the move. And let's go ahead and set you into forward. Go ahead and set that brake. Notch one. Notch two. I like that smoke that comes out of that smokestack right there. That looks that that this is cool. That's awesome. That smoke is awesome. Or the exhaust. There's another freighter right there. Every every freighter I've seen has Jeevos. I have not seen a freight train without Jeevos today, and they're all well one of them was an intermodal, one of them's a, that's a mixed freight it looks like. There we go. Start slowing her down. We can probably speed her up a little bit more to get to our safety stop here. There we go. Okay, so I see what they want us to do. They do want us to take these and couple onto that over there I see now alright so they do want us to um, hook onto these cars right here and then I'm assuming that we're going to pull everything forward or backwards I guess since the locomotive is facing back for facing uh, towards the center beams We'll move everything backwards, couple on the center beams, and then decouple these two cars, and I guess that's going to call it a day. I guess. I'm assuming I'm not quite positive. Alright, let's go ahead and couple these bad boys on. Oh, 
notch two, which usually will throttle these bat this bad boy up with vehicles. There we go. Center beams form the rear of the westbound mixed freight train. Couple to the waiting train and then couple them to your switcher to complete. Alright. Alright, can I turn my beacon light on? Hold on, I want to turn the beacon light on. Step lights, beacon light, there we go. Cabloid, I don't think I really need. Yeah, it's on. It doesn't really do anything, but it's on. This locomotive does struggle a lot, I have noticed that. But it is a tiny little switcher, so I mean, there's not much I can really say about it. There's a BNSF freighter that came in the direction we were. So I remember they had us switched off to the main line. So I'm not like 100% sure if that's where they're going to switch us off to. No, they're switching us off that way. Okay. I'm going to say I hope we're not being switched on to the main line here. Especially with all the main line freights that have been coming through. Look at that. Get a nice little view of a uh, intermodal train. I need to get containers that actually... Um, replace these because I have ones that replace the racetrack route uh, auto ra or uh, double stack cars but I need to find one that replaces these and I also found a couple other um, auto or uh, intermodal cars that I'll be working with here soon so stay tuned for all of those I'm very excited to be bringing those to you guys some more different mods and stuff like that for this game so here comes our switcher locomotive here Let's go ahead and move out of the way we got some light running Jeevos right there, boys. Look at those things running. Those things look amazing. Look at that. Some light running Jeevos. I wonder where those are going. That looked nice. That was cool, that flyby, though. That was amazing. Me and SF3417 restricting Shelby. Track. Restricting Shelby Yard uh, exit. I guess that's what that signal would be, is the exit. We're going to go around that platform there, but I don't think we're going to be hitting anything, so. We should be all good to clear once we cleared this. Uh, didn't realize we we're going to pick up this many auto rack, or this many center beam cars either. I don't understand why half of them are empty, then half of them are full. That don't make any sense to me. But yeah, we got one more car. BNSF 3417, one more car. 3417, give me half a car. 3417, that'll do anytime you're gonna stop. Alright, 3417, switch line for movement. We can shove back 2915. Give me about 100 cars, over. Pulling this was easy. Pushing is going to be the hard part. So I'll set it in the notch 4. So we can get that uh, extra oomph to push this thing. It's like it's a remote controlled locomotive. Alright, yep. We're switched to 2915. We're good. Alright, let's go ahead and head back to the other consist there. And I'll get back to you guys. All right, we're all good here on the safety stop. Let's go ahead and back these two up real quick, nice and easy. That one's moving. That car is moving. Let's back them up nice and easy. BNSF 3417, give me about two cars. One more 3417. Give me about half. How to do, 3417. All right, uncouple all your freight cars for a brief inspection. So I'm assuming I'm supposed to leave the two cars on there. Westbound train is now assembled correctly and can now meet its time slot. Good work. But I thought the lumber cars weren't supposed to be on that train. 
I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Do let me know by hitting that like button and that subscribe button. Follow all the social media. Y'all know what to do. And I'll catch you guys here on the next video. Hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.